Hello and welcome to a new year and a new semester. I'm Dr. Mary Hendricks Harris, the superintendent of the Francis House School District with a quarterly video update. We're excited that January is the official launch of our new Center for Advanced Professional Studies, or CAPS program. We've partnered with Spectrum Charter to create a program that will offer our students coursework in technology solutions. Students will gain professional skills in high demand, high skill technology solution careers, such as software engineering, graphic design, web development, and IT network support. Much of that work will be done at the Spectrum office in Maryland Heights, solving real world problems using Spectrum mentors and technology. We're not alone in these efforts. Next school year, there will be a countywide CAPS consortium comprised of all of the districts in St. Charles County. After much work last semester by our strategic planning team and plenty of feedback from our students, staff, parents, and community, I believe we have a strategic plan that will provide wonderful guidance for the next five years. The Board of Education will review the plan in January and vote to approve it in February. The next steps will be to put action teams into place as we begin living this plan. Thanks to all of you who participated in the process and provided your input. In December, the Francis Hall Board of Education voted to place a 48 cent operating levy on the April 3rd ballot. The tax levy has been named Proposition Learn since the revenue will be used to support student learning. The funds generated by the passage of Prop Learn will support technology upgrades, provide new programming and innovative courses, hire staff to address student needs and support struggling students, provide updated classroom materials, reinstate extracurricular budgets, and increase staff compensation after two years of frozen salary. A simple majority of votes are required in April to approve the increase in the operating levy. If the 48 cent levy increase is approved, a resident whose home is valued at $200,000 would pay approximately $15 more per month in property taxes. The last time voters in Francis Howell approved an operating tax levy increase was in 2004. The cost of goods and services associated with operating the school district continue to increase including utilities, transportation, insurance, and special education. Voters in every other school district in St. Charles County have approved a levy or bond issue in the past three years, but it's been 14 years since voters approved an operating levy in the Francis Hall School District. Our community has clearly stated their desire that Francis Hall continues to be an innovative, high-achieving school district. Proposition Learn would provide the necessary resources for the district to maintain the quality education our students deserve and our stakeholders have told us they want for our community. Many families choose to live in the district because of our high quality schools. Studies have confirmed the link between strong school districts and strong communities. A strong public school system maintains and enhances property values, provides a quality workforce, lowers crime rates, creates a better sense of community, and enhances public services. More information about the CAPS program, strategic planning, and proposition learn can all be found on the district website. Thanks again, we're all looking forward to a great second semester.